Wait, his name's Matthew? Yeah, his name's Matthew. Hi, Matthew. And uh, she wants us to do with the inverse challenge, which is basically we're going to do a series of events, and we're going to take the exact opposite car and we'll do that event. So oh. for drifting, we're taking the trackiest car possible. For track racing, we're taking either a drift car or an off-road car. Actually, yeah, we're going to take an off-road car, and for off-roading, we're taking a drift car. We're going to start off We're going to start off with a uh, little track race, so go ahead and get into a drift car. <laughs> well, that was in a, a perfect, class. perfect race car. Make and you're like, no, make it a class. Make it nice and good. And it doesn't have to be a good drift car. Just stick power on it. Oh, right, I can take this. You remember this? Oh my god, that thing's so A 2,000 pound car? Yeah, but it's not a, it's not a design as a drift car. That's my issue. It, it's good at drifting, but it's not a drift car. Okay, this one? Is that a drift car? Talking about photography, as he likely was. Okay. I'm in class. Everything's cool. On an easy I am okay. From light to shadow, from color to chiaroscuro. Now, can you give me an example of a photographer who perfectly captured the human condition in black? I didn't fall asleep, and that sure didn't feel like a dream. Weird. Diane Arbus. There you go, Victoria. Why Arbus? Because of her images of hope. Look at this crap. How can I show this to Mr. Jefferson? You feel like totally I can hear the class laughing at me now. She saw I should take a picture to prove I'm still here. Plus, it's perfect for my portfolio. And I have to get my daily selfie, Corva. I could frame any one of you in a dark corner and capture you in a moment of desperation. I believe Max has taken what you kids call a selfie. A dumb word for a wonderful photographic tradition. Max has a gift. Of course, as you all know, the photo portrait has been popular since the early 1800s. Your generation was not the first to use images for selfie expression. Sorry, I couldn't resist. 
The point remains that the portraiture has always been a vital aspect of art and photography for as long as it's been around. Now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits? You're asking me? L let me think. Um... You either know this or not, Max. Is there anybody here who knows their stuff? Louis Daguerre was a French painter who created daguerreotypes, a process that gave portraits a sharp reflective style like a mirror. Now you're totally stuck in the retro zone. Sad face. Very good, Victoria. The Daguerrean process brought out fine detail in people's faces, making them extremely popular from the 1800s onward. The first American daguerreotype self-portrait was done by Robert Cornelius. You can find out all about him in your textbook, or even online. And guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes contest. I'll fly out with the winner to San Francisco, where you'll be feted by the art world. It's great exposure, and it can kickstart a career in photography. So Stella and Alyssa, get it together. Taylor, don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry, too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. See me. <sighs> Victoria doesn't waste a second kissing ass. He's turning in a photo, so... You see the bill on I know, Mr. Jefferson. I just worked so hard in the shop, and I'm sure you know what it's like to be consumed by your work. I just really think Everyday Heroes is an important cultural event, and I want to represent Blackwell Academy. You have just by participating. Every time I look at Victoria, I feel like she's talking smack about me. Guys, this is just a bump on a bigger road. I don't want anybody to feel excluded from this process, but I also want everybody to know that this photograph... I see you, Max Caulfield. Don't even think about leaving here until we talk about your entry. I'd never let one of photography's future stars avoid handing in her picture. I didn't have any time. Way too much homework. Max, you're a better photographer than a liar. Now, I know it's a drag to hear some old dude lecture you, but life won't wait for you to play catch up. You're young, the world is yours, blah, 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 right? But you do have a gift. You have the fever to take images, to frame the world only the way you envision it. Now, all you need is the courage to share your gift with others. And that's what separates the artist from the amateur. You didn't tell me how cute I looked yet. I was about to. You are Welcome to the real world. Hot. Then I might send you a special picture. She plays it so shy. I need a serious time out in the bathroom. Splash water on my face and make sure I don't look like a total loser. I hate that class, it's so fucking boring. She's so fucking Gorgeous cheerleader. They must make them in a factory. 
I shouldn't be so catty. Dana is nice to me. That's Dana talking to, I think his name is Justin. To all of you, American girls in the movie. I hate having everybody no see inside my locker. American girls like dollies With shiny smiles and plastic bodies I wish I had An American It looks like she's been gone for months They should just call it a sugar machine. That would be awesome if you put money in there and a bag of sugar dropped out. I cry sometimes walking around my own place. Empty, good, good. Nobody can see my meltdown except for me. Just relax. Stop torturing yourself. You have a gift. Fuck it. When a door closes, a window opens. Or something like that. Okay, girl, you don't get a photo op like this every day. This poster must drive people to have sex. It's cool, Nathan. <laughs> Don't stress. You, you're okay, bro. Just count to three. Don't be scared. You own this school. If I wanted, I could blow it up. <laughs> you're the boss. So what do you want? I hope you check the perimeter, as my step-ass would say. Now, let's talk business. I got nothing for you. Wrong. You got hella cash. That's my family, not me. Oh, boo-hoo, poor little rich kid. I know you've been pumping drugs and shit to kids around here. I bet your respectable family would help me out if I went to them. Man, I can see the headlines now. Leave them out of this bitch! I can tell everybody Nathan Prescott is a punk ass who begs like a little girl and talks to himself. You don't know who the fuck I am or who you're messing around with. Where'd you get that? What are you doing? Come on, put that thing down! Don't ever tell me what to do! I'm so sick of people trying to control me! You are going to get in hella more trouble for this than drugs. Nobody would ever even miss your punk ass, would they? Get that gun away from me, psycho! No! Whoa. What the fuck? How? How can that be? I was in the bathroom. He shot that poor girl. 
I held up my hand, and then I was back here. Yes, he likely was. These pieces of time can frame us. I already world. heard this lecture. From light to shadow. From color to Now shadow. Kate is being hassled again. And if Victoria's phone rings, this is real. Now, Shit! Can you give me an example of Man, a photographer? I cannot believe this. We captured the human condition in black and white. Okay, if I'm crazy, I might as well go all the way. Bueller. Diane. Can I actually reverse there time? You go, Victoria. Why Arvis? Because of her images of hopeless faces. You feel like. I actually did it. A photographer who perfectly I'm captured a human the human time machine. And white. Anybody? Bueller? Max, don't Not freak yet, out. Arvis. Not yet. There you go, Victoria. Why Arvis? Because of Keep it together, Max. You feel like totally haunted by the eyes of those sad mothers and When children. I took myself, she what is going on? Nothing has moved at all. And frankly, it's bullshit. Shh, 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 shh. Keep that to yourself. Seriously, though. I could frame any one of you in a dark corner and capture you in a moment of desperation. If anybody else looked at this, what would they think? And any one of you could do that to me. Isn't that too easy? Too obvious? What if Arbus chose to capture people at the height of their or innocence? Still the same stupid picture. So everything seems the same as before. She could have taken another approach. I have to admit, I'm not a big fan of her work. I prefer Robert Frank. Me too, Victoria. He captured the essence of post-war beat America. And there was honesty about the economic conditions of the era, but a beauty in the struggle. You don't have beauty without a beat, which explains why Frank was Kerouac's photographic muse, and both were the great chroniclers of the 1950s. Well, we've all seen that iconic shot of Kerouac My on the My pencil balcony. case is still in the same place. Shame, shame. Capturing the romantic urban solitude of the 20th century poet. You dig? Now. Contrast Frank's stark Americana with Salvador Dali's surrealist photographs. Like Arthur, Cocteau, my old broken camera is new again. Man. And his famous self-portraits are famous early examples of that truly awful word you pesky kids love so much. The selfie. And it's a great tradition, and I wholeheartedly fight for your right to self-expression. I believe Max has taken what you kids call a selfie. A dumb word for a wonderful photographic tradition. And Max... As a gift. I know I'm not of dreaming course, this. You all know, the it's real. Has been I can tell. The early 1800s. Your generation so I can go back in time. For selfie expression. What if that girl so, isn't dead yet? I couldn't resist. The point can I save her? Portraiture has always been a vital aspect of art and photography. For I need to go to the bathroom quickly and check it out. Now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please... Tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits. I'm sorry, but I really have to use the bathroom. Nice try, Max. But you're not going to get away that easy. We can talk more after class. Is there anybody oh, here shit. who knows there's Jefferson a wants to keep me I after class. And I need time to save that girl. Types. A process that gave portraits a sharp reflective style like a mirror. Now you're totally stuck in the retro zone. Sad face. Very good, Victoria. What if I rewind the again and give him the right answer? Detail in people's faces, making them extremely popular from the 1800s onward.
Yeah, Max. Since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits? The Daguerrean process, invented by a French painter named Louis Daguerre around 1830. Somebody has been reading as well as posing. Nice work, Max. The Daguerrean process made portraiture hugely popular, mainly because it gave the subjects clear defined features. You can learn more when you actually finish reading the assigned chapters. Max is so far way ahead of everyone. And guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes contest. I'll fly out with the winner to San Francisco, where you'll be feted by the art world. It's great exposure, and it can kickstart a career in photography. So Stella and Alyssa, get it together. Taylor, don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry, too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. Max, you are not crazy. You are not dreaming. It's time to be an Everyday Hero. I should have known. She'll have better equipment than Blackwell. That girl needs your help now. This might make a cool shot. I also want everybody to know that this photographic world is not for everybody. I had my moment in the camera. I, mean, everybody oh, should I, I only want to share whatever gifts I have in the world. I see you, Max Caulfield. Don't even think about leaving here until we talk about your entry. I'd never let one of photography's future stars avoid handing in her picture. I'm not avoiding, just... Biding time? Waiting for the elusive right moment? Exactly. Max, don't wait too long. John Lennon once said that life is what happens while you're busy making other plans. Go on now. Don't let me stop you. hasn't moved from that spot. I see you, Max Caulfield. Don't even think about leaving here until we talk about your entry. I'd never let one of photography's future stars avoid handing in her picture. I'm on top of it. I think John Lennon once said that life is what happens while you're busy making other plans. Max, you're on fire today. All the right answers, good. Make sure you finish working on it by today. I have faith in you. I have enough time to get to the I have enough time to get to the bathroom. Please, please. I can't tell anybody. They'll think I'm crazy. Because Max wants everybody to see have to get my education on. Yo, Daniel! You know I don't tease. I hate that science class with those nerds. What's that got to do with Okay, Max, retrace every step. I washed my face. I shredded my photo, then the butterfly flew in, and I took a photo. 
leave them out of this bitch. I can tell everybody Nathan Prescott is a punk ass who begs like a little girl and talks to himself. You don't know who the fuck I am or who you're messing around with. Where'd you get that? What are you doing? Come on, put don't that thing down. Ever tell me what to do. Well, sir, it's happening again. People trying to control me. You are going to get in hella more trouble for this than drugs. No, he has a gun. I should do something else. Get that gun away from me, psycho! Oh. Holy shit, I can't let this happen. No. If I can reverse time no, again, no, 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 I can no. help her. Max, rewind now. Don't ever tell me what to do. I'm so sick. I'm too I'm scared to get near to this cypher. You are going to get in hella more trouble for this than drugs. Nobody would ever even miss your punk ass, would they? Get that gun away from me, psycho! Oh, shit! No! No, 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 no! I wonder how we'll get around this. Don't ever tell me what to do. I'm so sick of people trying to control me! You are going to get in hella more trouble for this than drugs. Nobody would ever even miss your punk ass, would they? Get that gun away from me, psycho! Oh! I need a hammer to break it open. No, 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 no! Would ever even miss your punk ass, would they? Get that gun away from me, psycho! Oh, shit! No, 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 no! Nobody would ever even miss your punk ass, would they? Get that gun away from me, psycho! Oh, shit! No, 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 no! Sick of people trying to control me! You are going to get in hella more trouble for this than drugs. Nobody would ever even miss your punk ass, would they? Get that gun away from me, psycho! Oh, shit! No, 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 no! Max, rewind now! Tell me what to do. I'm so sick of people trying to control me! You are going to get in hella more trouble for this than drugs. Nobody would ever even miss your punk ass, would they? Get that gun away from me, psycho! Oh. I need a hammer to break it open. No, 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 no! Max, rewind now! To control me. You are going to get in hella more trouble for this than drugs. Nobody would ever even miss your punk ass, would they? Get that gun away from me, psycho! Oh, shit! No, 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 no! I wonder how we'll get around this. Tell me what to do. I'm so sick of people trying to control me! No way! Don't ever touch me again, freak! Another shitty day. That did not happen. This cannot be real. I just saw a girl get shot and then saved her. What the fuck is going on? Do not freak out. Hey, do you hear that fire alarm? That means you should be outside. I had to use the bathroom. Girls always use that excuse. Excuse for what? For whatever you're up to. Your face is covered in guilt. The alarm tripped me out. Then trip on out of here, missy. Or are you hiding something? Huh? Thank you, Mr. Madsen. 
The situation is under control. There's no emergency here. Leave Miss Caulfield alone and please turn off that alarm since that's your job. a little stressed out. Are you okay? I'm... I'm just a little worried about my future. You're sweating pinballs. Is that all you're thinking about? You could always be up front with me, Max. Or have you done something wrong? Is that it? Well, Max, talk to me. I just got sick in class. Um... Female trouble. Except you're wandering around like a zombie. And do you think that's the first time a student has used that line on me? It's the truth. I felt dizzy in Mr. Jefferson's Just class. Just tell me what you're hiding. You can trust me. There's nothing to hide. I got sick. It happens, you know. There's that teen toot again. You know, I've, I've heard enough. Don't think I don't know what goes on around here. You've only been here for three weeks and you're already causing conflict. I don't think your parents will approve when they find out. Now get outside with the class. Please. No, he does not buy that at all. I may have just flushed my scholarship down the toilet. Yes, I could rewind an actual... Rachel Amber. She looks so hopeful and pretty. I wonder what happened to her. has been so insane. Everything is happening too fast. And none of it makes any sense. These visions, this power. I keep expecting to wake up one more time. But if this is a dream, then I'm not asleep. Which means somehow I did rewind time. So there has to be a reason, and I have to find out why. Hi, Miss Grant. Excuse me, Max. I know everybody loves being asked to sign a petition, but would you do Miss Grant a favor and hear me out? Sure, I always have time for you. What's the petition? David Madsen, our chief of security, wants to put surveillance cameras all around the campus. Halls, classrooms, gym, dorm rooms, etc. Blackwell Academy should be a high school, not a high security penitentiary. Thank you. 
I guess cameras could have helped Rachel. I can see both sides. You're fair-minded, Max. And we all pray Rachel is found safe and sound, bless her soul. But this petition isn't about her. Blackwell Academy has a noble heritage, from the Native Americans who founded this land to the pioneers who shared it in peace, not fear and violence. Blackwell is that old? That's incredible. You should learn a little history about your alma mater. You'll find some fascinating facts. There's a lot of power in this region. I think it helps the creative juices flow around here. Now, before I assign you homework with this lecture, will you please sign the petition to keep our campus from going back to 1984? Absolutely. I don't mind security, but not your surveillance. I knew you were my favorite new student at Blackwell for a good reason. This is a great image. All those rippling green coins. I hope everybody... I better read Warren's text before he blows my phone up. Better get to my dorm and grab that flash drive. Yo, Justin. Check out the Max. Come to Thrash? Oh, yeah? Bring it. What's your first move gonna be? Uh, jump? You're such a poser. If you can't even name a simple nose slide or a tray flip, you should walk on. I don't want to go that way. What's up, Daniel? Oh, hi, Max. Could I, um, ask you a question? Would you mind letting me sketch you? I do put my sketches on Facebook, though. I'd be honored, Daniel. Makes me feel like a muse. Funny you should say that. I was just thinking about my real muse. Rachel Amber. Okay. Why don't you start drawing me? Even though I must be a step down from Rachel. No way, you're a good substitute use. Oh, that's a good posture. Good, good. Best portrait ever. That's one of his famous shots. I love how it captures the moment. Evan's portfolio always looks so uber pro. I'd love to see his photos in there. Hey, Evan. Mind if I check out your cool portfolio? Let's see if you're worthy of it, Max. You'll have to answer a simple question. Who photographed the famous falling soldier? Uh, Steve McCurry? 
Unless he could travel back in time. Curry was born five years after the falling soldier picture. And Curry also shoots in color. In other words, no portfolio. Sorry, I have to get back to my portfolio. No time for amateurs. No offense, Max. 